Alright guys, William here and uh, today we have my dad here. Hi guys. And it's been a long time since we last shot our video so uh, we're going to try to do another video here. Uh, show you some updates. Maybe you got some solenoids here maybe. Uh, these do work on I mean. These do work. Yep, so. we got everything. Uh... Yeah. Everything figured out pretty much, but we're, the wiring's a mess and we still haven't finished everything completely. But we are moving next month. Tell them we're moving. We're moving like north of Texas, like for stuff. You're gonna be able to shoot all the cool Wednesday siren videos. So we'll keep you up to date on that. But uh, everything here is pretty much made out of, of from a 3D printer. 90% of it is PLA filament. Uh, it's taken a lot of work. We've uh, done everything on a CAD system. Uh, everything that you see here is designed by me and William. We've spent a lot of time. It took so long to get this, uh, to make sure everything's done correctly. But uh, we have two different types of solenoids we're working with today. We have, they're both 12 volt, working off of uh, a single 12 volt, uh, what is it, a little car battery. And uh, we also have a six volt battery that's working the rotator to rotate everything. And, uh, well, the, to rotate the entire siren, like you can see here. So it's spinning a little bit. Oh, but we're still working on everything, so it's a little uneven. But, uh, and then we also have a, another, an 18 volt that's working the actual rotor. Uh, it's taking a lot of time. Uh, down here to control the solenoids, I'll show you that in a second. Um, it's a two channel programmable time delay module. It's, I don't know if you can see it there, but I'll know, turn it on in a second. But for some odd reason, we're having, uh, you know, it's creating a lot of heat in the solenoid, so we haven't really had the uh, opportunity to uh, work it with a switch yet. Just try to t turn it off. But as you guys can see, see it lights up there. We have a programmed, so it's a uh, two second interval. One side to open, one side to close. I don't know if you guys can see that. But we're going to fire it up. We also have a, um, what is this, a bed pump, like an air pump that's in here. Uh, that's just plugged directly in to 110 outlet. Um, we're going to fire that up. That, uh, that'll throw some extra air on it, make it sound better. Because you can hear, guys, without that, it doesn't sound really great. See how weak it sounds? It sounds weak. William was not happy about that. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, so it's basically on. an air mattress one. So we're going to fire that up right. rotating it's basically silent but we're eventually going to work on this to the point where we could possibly sell them or do a giveaway so you guys got to keep in the loop find out what's going on with us but see uh, we uh, we're trying to organize the switches we we uh, have two on off switches once again obviously for to rotate uh, another controls the actual power to the rotor but we also have a controller that uh, controls how fast we're gonna go. But we have to also figure out uh, what the correct tone is for everything. So we'll keep you guys updated 
And if you have any questions and answers, we'll be answering them on our uh, next video. Anything to say? Make sure to follow and subscribe for more updates, you know. Have a good day, guys.